A local hotshot crew is getting ready to return to the front lines on a raging wildfire. Justin Shecker is live this morning on the northwest side with more on their latest deployment. Justin. Hey, Greg and Corinne, the 20 Ironwood hotshots have left Northwest Fire Station 33 in the past hour. They're on their way to the airport where they'll catch a flight to Boise, Idaho, where they'll meet in the base camp there. Now, these firefighters, they're the best of the best when not fighting fires here in Arizona. They answer the call to go elsewhere in the United States. They've been home the past three days on a mandatory break after having spent the past month fighting fires in Idaho. These images you're looking at from the Yosemite fire are what they could be up against next, but they're en route to Idaho, not knowing their next deployment. You know, it, it's kind of a dice roll. We kind of, our fate's kind of in uh, Boise's hands. That's kind of who we work for. So um, I, I would say uh, big chance of going to that, the big one in uh, California. And this morning, that Yosemite fire is only 20% contained. Now, most of these Ironwood hot shots are seasonal employees, so they work from the beginning of spring through the fall. The superintendent tells us it's been a difficult season between the tragedy at Yarnell Hill and the difficult conditions in the Northwest. But this morning, he tells us his team is prepared to get back on the front lines. We're live this morning on the Northwest side. I'm Justin Shecker, KGUN 9 on your side. I've been